Have you ever wondered about the mystical concept of merging senses into the heart, reaching the center of the lotus, as the ancients described? Today we delve into this intriguing practice, breaking it down into comprehensible segments. Imagine touching someone. If you're a heart-centered person, that touch will quickly reach your heart, allowing you to perceive its quality. If you hold the hand of a head-centered person, you'll find it cold, not physically, but emotionally. There will be a certain lifelessness in it. But if the person is heart-centered, their hand will radiate warmth. It will start melting with yours. Something will flow from their hand into you, creating a harmony, a dialogue of warmth. This warmth is coming from the heart. It cannot come from the mind, for the mind is always cold and calculative. The heart is warm, it is not calculative. Touch, feel. Close your eyes and touch something. Touch your lover, your mother, your child, a friend, a tree, a flower, or simply the earth. With your eyes closed, feel the inner dialogue happening between the earth and your heart, between your lover and you. Think of your hand as your heart reaching out to touch the earth. Let the sensation of touch connect with your heart. When you're listening to music, don't listen with your mind. Forget your mind and imagine yourself as a headless being. It might be helpful to keep a picture in your sleeping room, a picture of yourself without a head. Focus on it and imagine yourself headless. Don't let the head interfere and listen to the music with your heart. Feel the music flowing into your heart. Let your heart resonate with the music. Let your senses also connect with the heart, not the mind. Practice this with all senses and increasingly feel that each sensory experience goes into the heart and dissolves in it. In summary, we explored the ancient practice of merging senses into the heart, touching and feeling with the heart, listening with the heart, and letting each sensory experience dissolve into the heart. This path leads us to the center of the lotus, a state of profound peace and unity. Embrace this practice, for it opens the door to a deeper understanding of ourselves and the world around us.